Well, I didn't do the high idle mod yet. That's going to be coming. Um, I did do the glow plug relay, over override, whatever the fuck you want to call it. But um, I'll be doing the high idle mod hopefully, I don't know, a couple days. I need to pick up a toggle switch for it. So I have this one at least. I'll show you how to do it. Mine's already in because I did it yesterday. I had to make sure it was going to work. But it's pretty self-explanatory once I show you how to do it. So, all right, this is how you do it. Come over here to your glow plug relay. See these two caps right here? There's one here, one here. Those are your power going into your relay. Um, I have a ground issue, so I actually unhook the relay. You don't have to. Um... Because before I was just arcing it, but you take two balls, you take two wires, run it to one to each side. This is where normal people run it through. But as you can see, I already got a whole bunch of shit going through there, and I wasn't going to try to feed any more wires through there. All right, messed up my boost tube once, so I came over to here to this grommet. <sighs> Uh, if you look down there, there's a grommet. See the big red and black wire? Anyway, it drops in right above your heater box. Can you unlock those, my door for me, hon? Comes in down through here. I ran the wires all the way through there. So when you run your wires, run them all the way up into your dashboard. I am putting a switch panel in here at some point. I just haven't done it yet, so I just did this one temporarily. These things pop right out. Just like that. Take your... Ooh. Your two wires that you have running up, connect them to your switch. I use the push button because it was a lot easier. Plus, that way you don't overheat your glow plugs. So it's just like that. And you come up to here. And if you do everything right, it should just do this. Like I said, these three... All three of them pop right out. So, I mean, if you don't want to put a switch panel in, they all come out. You can drill it. I can put a switch right into that. I slide right back up into place. Once I put my CD player in and stuff, I'm going to take this whole unit out, get a piece of stainless steel. I'm going to drill a bunch of holes in it for different switches. I'm going to run everything off that. Get another one of these push buttons like this. I'm going to run my horn off that. Same on this side. These pop right out. And you can put those in. So, that's how you do the override for your glow plugs. Because I'll do the high idle mod next. <laughs> 